I mean, that's what we see in the animal kingdom. Did you see that documentary about the octopus? Yeah, it, it was just, I mean, I thought it was a beautiful documentary, but... Um, the TLDR for anyone that hasn't seen it is once the octopus, and I'm going to completely butcher this, so please ignore. Um, once the octopus has given birth, it dies. Basically, it doesn't move out of that hole and it dies. Does the octopus die after reproduction? And it says yes. Female octopuses die after their eggs hatch. After laying eggs, a female stops eating and devotes all of her, her energy to protecting and oxygenating them until they hatch. Once they do, she dies shortly after. This death is triggered by hormone changes from the optic gland, similar to mammalian pituitary glands. And males die shortly after mating as well, usually within a few months. That is wild. In some ways, it's, you know, it's, it's, it's tragic and it reminds me, I'm so glad that I'm not an octopus. Certainly what we know is that the number of individuals who can survive on six hours of sleep or less and show no impairment in either their brain or their body, rounded to a whole number and expressed as a percent of the population, is zero. 